Welcome to the Cherries TV. <laughs> Welcome to Cherry TV. My name is Abby and I'm a fragrance lover. I love anything that smells, feels, and smells good, you guys. Welcome back to another video. If it's your first time here, my name is Abby and on this channel we talk about fragrances. Anything that has to do with smelling good, feeling good, that's what we talk about. And if that sounds like something that you're definitely interested in, grab a seat, grab a drink, hit that subscribe button. And before you turn on that notification bell, I also wanted to tell you guys that I do lifestyle on here too every Mondays. So go ahead and turn on that notification bell so that you'll be notified for every single video that I do post. And don't forget to put it on all. All right, you guys. So by the title of this video, you already know it's about to get down. Today, I'm about to share with you guys 10 of the worst fragrances to wear during the heat time. These are some fragrances that you do not want to wear during the heat time it is so hot outside and i know i know i know i know i live in florida so i always say that i don't care i'll wear my fragrance whenever i want how i want it but if you're that type of person that goes with the season then this video is for you because these fragrances you definitely want to avoid during the heat if you want to find out what fragrances these are, go ahead and keep on watching. <laughs> the first fragrance is one from the house of Lancome. And it is one that I truly, truly love, but I just cannot wear it during the heat time. And I would not suggest to wear this during the heat time, even though sometimes I will sneak it in during the nighttime, but mm -mm, you just definitely can't wear this. And it is from the house of Lancome, their private collection, and it is called Oud bouquet now this one is a mixture of oud praline rose powdery notes spicy notes and um some sweet notes it is so sexy though y'all it is so good this is one of the fragrances one of the first fragrances that i fell in love from the private blend oud bouquet is always gonna have a place in my heart and sometimes i would love to wear her during the summertime but it's hard to wear because it is so hot and humid here in Florida this ain't gonna work so if you are the type of person that likes this fragrance or you have it this would not work especially if you don't want to choke out the next fragrance is one from the house of Christian Dior Dior <laughs> Christian Dior Dior hey 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 every time I hear that I remember the song but uh this is one that is called Tobacular and this is one that you definitely want to avoid if you have it in your collection during the summertime. It is a bomb fragrance. It's sexy. It's alluring. It has tobacco. It has that honey. It has that smoke. And it also has that sweetness. But this right here, you, you, you will choke out. You definitely will choke out. Now, we've had some days here in, the, um, in Florida where it's rained and... Um, my husband pulled this out he's low-key trying to claim this as his but i'm not gonna let that happen but he pulled it out and it smelled divine it's so sexy <sighs> it's slowly climbing up to be one of my favorite tobacco fragrances i'm not even gonna front i'm not even gonna cap like these people say nowadays i ain't even gonna cap with your babes this is one that i probably will be wearing <sighs> I'm not. I'm trying not to wear it during the, the, the summertime. Just know that. But it's beautiful. It's one that you really will choke out if you wear it because it's so heavy and dense. You don't want to wear this during the spring and summertime. The next fragrance is one from the house of Boys 1920, Dolce Di Girano. This one is a beautiful, beautiful fragrance. It has cinnamon. It has woody notes. This is a very spicy, woody fragrance, especially for the winter time. You do not want to wear this during the heat because first of all, that pepper in this fragrance with that cinnamon will choke someone out, you guys. This is probably one of the worst fragrances to wear during the warm days. Now, the warm nights, you can kinda, kinda, kinda sneak, you know, you could kinda get away with this one, but it's definitely one that I would suggest to wear during the fall time 
and the winter time because it's just not gonna work. It's just not gonna work. Let's, let's just say that. It's just not gonna work. It's not gonna work. The next one is from the House of Nishane and it's one of my favorites from the House of Nishane and it is Nishane Ani. You guys all know that Ani is definitely one for the fall and the winter time. This is one that I've sneaked into the spring and the summertime but when I tell y'all I had a really bad experience with this, I was choking. When I tell y'all I was choking, I was choking. This is very strong. Now it did perform really nice nicely but it was just extra warm and just like sticky icky on me I, it made me feel sticky and icky it smelled amazing people gave me compliments but a lot of people were saying that oh you're so strong you smell so strong i highly suggest to wear this if you're trying to wear it during some time at night time but it's not gonna wear really well in the heat it's just not this next fragrance is one from the house of killian and it is my favorite from the house of killian and it is angel shares now you could already tell this is screaming um winter and fall vibes this is one that i love to wear during the fall and winter time for partying and going up to different type of events because i know i will blast someone out with the scent it is so strong and it is the projection on this is crazy so that's one that i always wear when i'm going out to parties this is one that you don't want to wear during the um springtime or the summertime I've tried this one as well. I, I always try my winter fragrances to make sure that I can wear them all year round because before I tell you that a fragrance is all year round, I try to make sure I tested it out beforehand. And this is one that definitely didn't work because this is very sweet. And um, the sweetness in this gave me a headache during the, the heat time, the, the, during the summertime. I don't know what it was with the heat in this, it just did not mix. It was so bad that I had to go back home and wash off my the parts that the parts of my skin that I sprayed it on and reapply another fragrance and put a different outfit on because it just was not working, y'all. But um, for some people it can work, but me it just did not work because that headache was just unbearable. The next fragrance is one from MFK and it's one of the only fragrances from MFK that I own in my collection that I really feel like you cannot wear during the spring or summertime, and it is MFK. Oud Silk Mode. Oud is a note that you can wear all year round, but it's one of those notes that it depends on how they make it. If it's a barnyard oud, if it's a fresh oud, if it's an ar aromatic oud. This is definitely not fresh or aromatic at all. This is just straight up oud, okay? So right now, during this time of year, you cannot wear it. I try to sneak it in to the springtime right now because it's spring and the days that it's raining because it's more cool outside. But like, let's say it's not raining and the sun is out, baby, this is not gonna work at all for you. And um, it's sexy, it's beautiful, it's alluring, but it's just not gonna work. It's a nice oud and rose combo, just not for the spring and summer. The next fragrance is one from the house of Replica and it is replicas by the fireplace all right you guys whenever you hear the name by the fireplace you already know what type of weather you can wear this cold cozy weather or even rainy cool weather i tried to wear it the other day it was about 85 degrees not as hot as it usually is like a 95 and up but baby it just didn't work it just won't work <laughs> It didn't work. I just felt like I was choking. And these fragrances usually don't do that. But I, when I tell you I feel like I'm choking, I feel like I'm about to like, like I need air, I need air. And this fragrance is just too much. Like the heat amplifies the fragrance a little too much for me. It's a sexy one. I would definitely wear it during the nighttime, but I probably spray it in the air, choop, and then walk into it. Baby, I just can't. The next one is from the House of MFK. Now this one, I've worn it during the winter time and the fall time and the spring and the summer. And I technically didn't have no problem with it. But if you're that type of person that needs to know whether you can wear it during the spring or the summertime, most people would not. So I would say no. I'm a little bit more bold and I don't care about how people feel sometimes when it comes to my fragrance. So I've worn it and I almost choked, but I didn't choke too much and soir now from the name alone grand soir soir means night grand is grand you can wear it during the night time i personally think that it's good during the fall and winter but i've worn this summer nights and it didn't really go that bad but definitely one that most people would not wear during the 
summertime so if you're that type of person that mm, can i can i not i would say no but like me probably would but to each his own this is one that I'm not gonna choke you out too much it just depends on how you spray this one the next one is from the house of m mikalef and it is one that's called note vanille and my juice is getting darker by the minute <laughs> but this is one that you cannot wear it's boozy, it's heavy, it's dense, it's a boozy vanilla fragrance. You can definitely wear it to a bed, but during the summertime, you cannot wear this out because it will be too heavy and dense, especially if you're in Florida. It is gonna get sweaty, you're gonna be sweating, and you don't wanna that sweat mixing with this fragrance. It's just not gonna work, only because it is heavy. Now, if you're that type of person like me, they don't care, you can wear this. I haven't tried this in the summertime, but I could tell but i could already tell that it's gonna be too much for the summertime now if you want to go ahead and try it but me personally yeah no mm -mm. i'm gonna keep it in the fall and winter maybe spring nights but that's about it <laughs> and the last one is one that you definitely can't wear during the summertime and it's one from the house of roja and it is roja amber eye oud oh uh, man that dark juice already tells you no 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 but the fragrance is a heavy oud fragrance. It's a little bit powdery too, which I feel like can kind of work, but me definitely no. I got it during the summertime. Did I get it during the summertime? Yeah, I think I got it during the summertime or towards the summer going to the fall time. And it didn't work at the time. It only worked during like the heavy, cool winter type nights, which I didn't have a problem with because we do have those once a year. If you're that type of girl that has this and you want to know if you can, just don't, girl. Unless you want to choke out, don't wear it. Don't say I didn't warn you. <laughs> and that was it for the video, guys. Thank you so much for joining me here yet again for another video. If you are new here and you made it this far, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, babes, because at this point, you like me, I like you, we can't live without each other. So go ahead and click that subscribe button. It's definitely free, okay? Go ahead and hit that link in the description box below and leave your girl a testimonial on how I impacted you through my content, guys. Go ahead and hit that link. Let them know. Let Sephora Squad know. I would love to be part of the Sephora Squad. I would love to be part of the Sephora Squad. And guys, guess what? It is definitely free to leave the testimonial. testimonial. And you could definitely leave way more than one. Just saying, just putting that out there for the girls that love me a little extra. All right, you guys, thank you so much for joining me here. Don't forget that I do post every Tuesdays, Fridays, and Sundays at 5 p.m. for fragrance content and every Monday for my lifestyle content. All right, guys, until we meet again, please, 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 please stay safe and keep on smelling fragrances. Bye. <laughs>